being successful in a particular field, especially sales, does not happen overnight. It requires hard work, dedication, and commitment. It do require your hard work for you to make it. There is nothing easy. There is nothing shortcut. It, it doesn't exist. It's probably easy for you because you already you already went through the shaping part. When when people say, "Oh, it's easier being a criminal," no, it's because you already been formed as a criminal. You already been built as a criminal. That's that's already in your blood. So therefore, it comes off as like shortcut. Achievement seems to be connected with action. Successful men and women keep moving. They make mistakes, but they don't quit. Accept the mistakes that you make in life. Just don't quit. A lot of people want to have money. A lot of people want to succeed in life, but nobody want to put in the work. Nobody want to understand that it's going to get hard. Nobody want to understand that sometimes you got to go in the dirt, dirt. Sometimes it means that you got to, you're going to cry. You're going to sweat. You're going to get hurt. You're going to shed some tears. You're going to shed some blood sometimes, depending on how hard. It means that you're going to have to work at it. But at the end of the day, you can't quit. You can't accept quit. You can't accept to just throw in the towel. You can't just walk around and think like it's going to get easy just like that. A lot of people don't want you to make it. A lot of people already fails. So they're like, why you think you're going to make it? And if you're going to sit there and take, take the reasons why they didn't make it, you're going to Failure is not the opposite of success. It's part of success. Push yourself because no one else is going to do it for you. Who else were you thinking was going? There's nobody there to to really push you the way you need to push yourself. Some people might come and give you advice, but it's based off of like, oh, you're my friend. And I want you to do good and keep on going. That's not really a push. That is something that is just there to be. The real push comes from yourself. The real push comes from your own power. When you, when you tap back into the vision that you had, when you tap back into the reasons why you got started, when you tap back into the, your failures and the mud that you've been through, when you tap back into the past, that's the real push. That's the real motive. That's the real motivation. Stop playing. Stop playing small. Stop seeing from like a little point of view. You need you need a whole telescope to see 10 years ahead. 